What's going on everyone? Colby here with Colby's Cards and today I uh, just got back from Target and actually hit a Target restock. Um, I did see some update hanger packs or just retail packs, the $3 ones on the, they were actually on like one of the hanger things. Um, and then I actually found these Chronicles hanger packs, like the actual hanger packs. Uh, and believe it or not, these are only like $6.99. Um, so definitely couldn't pass those up. There was like five or six of them. I only grabbed two and then I also grabbed this archives baseball um, Blaster box, so I did open one of those off off camera didn't pull anything too crazy I think I got my best card was like a Jake Berger rookie card um, Numbered out, like out of 199 or something like that um, And then I also did get these in the mail today. Um, I've been ordering two of each wave of the Topps T206 or Topps 206 cards. Um, so I'm going to do these in a separate video. I'm also going to do the archives in a separate video, uh, but just wanted to give you a little preview of what is to come. But today I'm going to do these two hanger packs from Chronicles. Uh, so if you want to take a look, these aren't really the best, I mean, they're not really odds. They just kind of tell you the breakdown of what you can find. Um, easiest way is to just open these from the bottom, at least from what I've found. Maybe not. Um, so in these, you are guaranteed. So there's 15 cards. Um, again, for only $6.99, I thought that was a decent value just because I know Chronicles in the past has been overpriced. Um, but you are guaranteed one exclusive pink Pulsar parallel per pack. So... Um, kind of their retail exclusive pinks, I guess you could say. Um, but we start off, so Chronicles is that like all kinds of different designs, um, types of cards. So excited to see what we can find. I did do a hobby box of this stuff as well. Um, so if you haven't seen that yet, go ahead and check that out. Here's a rookie card of Reed Detmers, um, a Chronicles of Jake Myers, Vlad Jr. Classics card, Tony Santian, Rookies and Stars, uh, John Heasley, rookie card on the Luminance design. All right, Jose Abreu for the uh, White Sox. I really like these cards. These, um, oh gosh, what's the type called? I can't even tell. Vortex, that's it. Uh, and a really nice Spencer Torkelson, so that's probably the best card we've gotten so far. A little bit of a dinged up corner at the top, uh, but still a nice card nonetheless. Do have a marquee Vidal Brujan rookie card. Really nice thick card stock there. Uh, Paul Goldschmidt on the acetate clear card, uh, clear vision. And then a Glenn Auto. We do have our pink card coming up next. It is a Mookie Betts Crusade pink parallel. Um, really nice looking parallel there. A little bit off center, left to right. Definitely thick on the left side, but still a cool looking card. And then we have a Jake Berger rookie card on the Titan and a Jake McCarthy rookie card on season ticket from Contenders. And this is nice, a uh, revolution of Brandon Crawford brings us home. So I'm going to check the backs real quick. Don't think there was anything numbered. I think usually those cards are pretty easy to tell when there's going to be numbering on them. Um, I think the best card is probably that Spencer Torkelson, even though it did have a dinged corner. So just checking the backs here out of these, nothing crazy, uh, but we can go ahead and open our second pack here. Again, only like seven bucks at Target, so not too bad on the price point. Uh, was kind of expecting them to be more expensive, just because again, Chronicles was really overpriced last year on the blaster boxes. So uh, here's probably my favorite card, the rookie of O'Neill Cruz. Got a Juan Soto Chronicles card, Kansas City, Bobby Witt Jr. So another really nice card out of these two packs. Nice rookie card there. Uh, we've got Colton Welker, Rodolfo Castro on the Vortex card. I really like these cards. They kind of feel really cool too. They're like textured as well. Just like that white theme to it. Uh, Edward Cabrera on the rookie card from Pinnacle flipping every which way. We've got a Connor Wong, Rookies and Stars. Um, is this Essentials, I think? Uh, essentials of the Jose Altuve, kind of a foil look there. We have a Luis Hill 
on the Clearly Donruss, another Acetate Clear, Ronald Acuna Jr. Elite. Here's our pink, and it is TJ Friedel. Kind of a weird looking parallel there with the pink on red type of thing going on. Uh, we do have another Rodolfo Castro season ticket rookie card, Francisco Lindor, and our last card is Rafi Dever. So a couple nice PC guys there, a couple nice Pirates cards as well for my PC. Uh, best card was probably the Bobby Witt, I would assume. I, I think this is the nicest design, uh, but the Bobby Witt was probably the best card followed by the Panini threads of O'Neill Cruz. So I uh, got those two, and then we also got that Torkelson in the first box. Definitely cannot complain, and I uh, appreciate you guys watching. Thanks so much, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, everyone.